Game ball right here, baby. <laughs> to my boy right here, D4. This the game ball, baby. I got that for you. I love you, boy. On a field full of all-stars, there was no mistaking whose star was brightest on Saturday. Auburn's Steve Ford was a one-man wrecking crew, spending much of his day in the north backfield. It was great, you know, uh, to be consistent. That's the biggest thing for me. I want to be consistent, so, so good. And moving forward, you just earned yourself some cash this, tonight. How does that feel like? Some cash. I don't do this for cash, man. I do this for pride. I do this because I really, I really, really want to be great, you know. The money will come. You know, I'm just all about you know perfecting what I do. Ford's tremendous Senior Bowl game topped off a tremendous Senior Bowl week, where he was a standout each day in practice, raising his draft stock and perhaps cementing a spot in the first round. I don't think about the outside. You know, I can't I can't think about things that can put stress in my life. If I'm thinking about impressing the coaches. That's stress. I'm all about pressure. You know what I'm saying? It was pressure to come out to perform. You know, them are things I can control, you know, so I can control how I play and how energetic I was, and uh, that's what I wanted to bring to the table. I wasn't worried about impressing anybody. I can't tell you about his stock, but I can tell you about his personality, and he came to work every day. Uh, you know, his, his attitude really permeated through the whole group, and uh, it was really a pleasure to work with him, and then to see a day like this, that's great. Well, that's what I wanted to show, man, my intangibles. It's one thing to have a player who balls, but it's one thing to have a player who has intangibles, you know. I want I see myself as a leader, and them, them are the things that you, know, you have to be and have to bring to the table. So today's great game tops off a great week, which tops off a great season for D Ford, whose Auburn Tigers went from the bottom of the SEC to within one minute of a national championship. It's hard to go through a losing season, but we didn't have any guys uh, on any individual things, you know, not no selfish acts going on. You know, we had a lot of guys trying to work, you know, after the season ended. You know, as bad as that season was, we had guys coming in, let's win. You know, just so happened, we got Miles on, that was a blessing, and he, he did a great job with the staff. And we just took it one game, one practice at a time, and we did it. Now it's over. Now it's over, man. You know, uh, I get sad some days, but, you know, like I said, them are things I can't control. You know, but I can control, you know, the future. It's a future that got even brighter in the Senior Bowl. And what a way to go out in Ford's final appearance wearing an Auburn helmet. In Mobile, Alabama, Paul Boron for CST Tonight.